hello guys you are welcome to this video in today's video i'll be showing you how to add a google translator to your wordpress website all right so if today is your first time of coming to my channel do well to subscribe and hit the notification bell all right without wasting much time let's dive into it so first of all you need to go to your dashboard log into your wordpress dashboard as you can see on the screen this is my wordpress dashboard so you move over to where you have your plugins when you see it, your plugins then you click on add new all right click on add new then you click on you come over to this place and search for google sorry google translator all right oh sorry i think i spelled that wrongly google google language translator yes google language translator so once you search for it like this so you can see it here this is this translates google language translator then you install once you install you activate all right you activate remember this is our site there's nothing showing on this side so i'll be showing you how once we do that to appear there then you now come over to where you have install plugins you want to install it to be there you come to google install can you see it here this is google language translator then you come to settings all right once you come to settings you can see right you can see all the languages so best of all, i will just say select all you can see these are the languages african french these are all the languages you can think of then i will come over to this part here then the next thing is you come to the widget show widget all right then translate allow to check where do you want it to show i don't want to show bottom i want to show top right all right i want to show top right then the background color depends on you these are the few things you need to do the you need to do when it comes to settings all right first of all you check all the you check all the languages you want right you have georgia german greek uh luzembongish Le slovenia you can see all the languages that are there all right so you have it there once you let me let me clear you can see it now then i will select all like i showed you before then choose the original original language to be english what do you want to be original language i said english then i select all of this okay then you come to the language switch setting 100 percent all right show the which do you want is it show the flag or show the country all right so you have it there okay then you come to the floating widget setting show the widget then what right up do you want to be there because you can see it's already showing on the down part but i would not like it to show you i want it to show up that's why i selected show at the top right can you see it now then you come down and click on settings then the last thing is the background color i want to change the background color i would like my own to be red okay is that red it depends on you rather it depends on whichever color you want to choose so but i'll just choose red then i'll come down and click on save changes click on save changes right can you see it now then if i come to my site and i reload can you see it showing up here can you see it now so this is how let's also take it to a different browser so we can see what we are talking about if i come to a different browser now I come here paste it okay it will still show so then i will show you how it is there okay so can you see the, the translator now this is it all right say translate then which language do i want to translate to can you see all the languages that is there all right the language these are different languages so if i say translate to this can you see it is translated can you see it it is translate to any language you can think of all right i say show original then i'll go back again which language do i want all right so I come back again. Which country? Which language do I want to translate to? Um, you can see this. All right, it will still translate. Can you see it? 
you can see the translation you can see the translation all right so any language you want it to translate to it will definitely translate to it okay that is how to add Google translator to your website okay hope you got value from this short video clip we just talked about all right do where to subscribe and turn on the notification bell all right see you in my next video